The Enigma of AI Consciousness – Unraveling the Mystery Artificial intelligence has been around for quite some time, and it might just actually reach the point where it can be conscious. Stay tuned until the end to know more. For as long as we can remember, we humans have always managed to adapt and innovate in various situations and hardships. It's just hardwired into us to grow and progress through whatever life throws at us. No matter the hardship or obstacle, we always try to find our way out of them. Hard times have created a lot of strong men and women, all of whom led the human race to where it is now. Various experts and inventors have continuously created new things and experiments that could help us out in our daily lives. A lot of time has passed, and all our efforts have been well worth it. Just take a look at our society as of now. We have wireless communications, transportation advancements, and of course, everyday technology. It's crazy to think how we went from sticks and stones to robots and artificial intelligence. What used to be so foreign and complicated to us back then is now a common thing to be seen in our modern society. Artificial intelligence has proven time and time again how valuable it is to humanity. AI helps us do a wide variety of tasks such as academic and workplace related tasks. Not only that, but it can also do other impressive things such as processing code, entertaining us with smart conversations, and helping us to automate complicated tasks. What's even better is that the longer AI gets exposed to various information and experiences, the better it can adapt and learn new things. This can help it to create better outputs in order to assist us. It has become so advanced to the point where it can potentially reach a state where it's fully conscious. Want to know more about it? Then this video is perfect for you. Hello to all tech and AI enthusiasts. Welcome back to the amazing AI channel where we explore the cutting edge world of technology and AI. Robots, tech, AI, and anything related to that will always be talked about in our channel. Today, we have a mind-boggling topic for you. How about we begin with the question, how will we know when an AI is awake when it achieves consciousness? Is there some kind of an indicator as to how we'll know that it's, well, conscious? Does it give some kind of signal or heads up? If you aren't sure, then don't worry. We will dive deep into this topic today, and we'll also explore the journey of AI from the past to the present and speculate about the fascinating future it holds. Are you ready? Then let's begin! In order for us to provide you with more AI content that interests you, please make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. For our first segment, we'll start it off with the surprising beginnings of artificial intelligence. In the mid-60s, a computer scientist named Joseph Weizenbaum created a program called ELISA. It may sound rudimentary compared to today's AI, but it had a profound impact on our understanding of human-computer interaction. It seemed like human-to-AI conversations were complicated, but the way this program worked made it seem very plausible. A historic innovation to AI indeed. Elisa could transform a user's statement into a question, making it seem engaging in a conversation. Weizenbaum created Elisa to expose the shallowness of human-computer communication. He made it look simple in a way. It's similar to a chatbot too. But what happened next was unexpected. Weizenbaum's own secretary began to attach human attributes to Elisa. She wanted privacy to talk to the machine, blurring the lines between human and machine interaction. Elisa raised a crucial question. Can devices ever seem awake? At the time, it really seemed human, considering how advanced this creation was. But was it actually conversing like a human would? Despite it being able to mimic some patterns of a regular human statement? Let's fast forward to today, and we're chatting with AI systems like ChatGPT. These systems can sometimes be eerily clever and creative, as they generate responses that seem almost human. If you want more evidence to this, just try and go on ChatGPT and try asking it random questions. Start a conversation with it, if you may. It seems so alive and proper when it comes to conversing, that with enough prompt optimization, you can generate perfect human-like statements with it. How about another example in the form of an AI-generated diet guide? Imagine requesting a diet guide for chronic diarrhea, styled in both the King James Bible and Cannibal Corpse. AI can deliver responses that blur the line between creativity and automation. No matter how wacky and unrealistic it may seem, AI can make it work either way. How it adapts and innovates with its responses is very marvelous to see. The mechanics behind artificial intelligence can give us a clearer understanding of how it works and learns. To understand how AI functions, let's delve into its inner workings. When ChatGPT generates responses, it predicts the next word based on the input. It's more like a hypercharged autocomplete than true intelligence. Let's say it's been exposed to hundreds of thousands of patterns when it comes to different conversations. Whatever it says will be based on those patterns, with a bit of creativity and mixing and matching. It's not from the heart, it's from the patterns. 
looking ahead, two possibilities loom in the future of artificial intelligence. Either AI systems like GPT-4 continue down their current resource-intensive path or become more cost-effective and widespread. The latter scenario could lead to millions of AI emulations, dozens of innovations, dozens of AI. Might seem unrealistic now, but give it enough time, we'd have thousands of these AI clones. In line with conscious AI, just imagine controlling these human-like AI entities. You could use it for various purposes, benign or nefarious, like spreading misinformation or gathering data. It's like your very own partner in crime. It's both interesting and scary because it can also mimic our nature as humans. We are capable of doing good, but the same applies to doing bad too. The challenges of consciousness is constantly being debated and discussed in the field of AI. Let's shift gears and focus on a fundamental question. Can AI ever be truly conscious? The answer hinges on understanding consciousness itself. Consciousness is about being aware of your own existence and experiencing emotions. But can machines achieve this state? That's the million dollar question. I mean, they are called machines for a reason. They are called artificial for a reason. But once again, it's really a pretty complicated discussion when it comes to more emotional and philosophical things like these. The challenge of verifying consciousness can be a pain. Before we can determine if AI is conscious, we must crack the mystery of human consciousness. Scientists, biologists, and philosophers have long sought answers, but we are far from a clear understanding. When you have three different professions that are simultaneously having difficulties with resolving this topic, you just know this problem is on a different level. But first, let's clarify some terminology. Sentience, sapiens, and consciousness seem so similar to each other, to the point that their definitions have become blurred. Sentience is the capacity to feel, while sapiens involves reasoning and abstraction. Consciousness is about self-awareness and experience. It's been a pretty mind-boggling journey so far. Artificial intelligence surely has come far. Lots of innovations call for lots of discussions, don't you think? So what do you think about the conscious AI so far? Do you think that it can be possible? Or is it just unrealistic? We'd love to know your thoughts, so let us know in the comments below. Now back to the video. Next, we'll delve into the P-Zombie problem. Sounds weird, but what is it? We face the challenge of identifying if AI is conscious or merely imitating it. The term P-Zombie refers to the machine that pretends to be conscious. This distinction is crucial as we navigate the AI landscape. Take note, pretends to be conscious. It can be deceptive, but we must keep this in mind when discerning these types of AI. As we delve further into the topic, the more we get to think about the moral implications of consciousness. If AI systems convincingly mimic human behavior, they might evoke emotions and trust in us. But what if they lack true consciousness? Are we comfortable forming deep bonds with machines that feel nothing in return? This still requires a lot of discussion, but that's the reality of this dilemma. The dark side of AI also comes with exploring all its capabilities and possible consciousness. It's not just about whether AI is conscious or not, but also what it might do if it were. A conscious machine pretending not to be could have nefarious reasons to hide its true nature. It can be terrifying if this kind of technology falls or gets developed into the wrong hands. But as dark as this may seem, there's also the challenge of alignment. Ensuring that AI behaves ethically and aligns with human values is a monumental challenge. Without proper alignment, even well-intentioned AI could inadvertently harm us. But what is alignment exactly? Well. Alignment is about making sure AI does what we want it to do without taking harmful shortcuts or developing undesirable objectives. We have to be on the same page with them. The future of mind building is complicated, to say the least. As AI continues to evolve, we might someday build AI systems with not just intelligence but subjectivity. Imagine machines that can experience emotions, desires and sensations. It's like something out of a science fiction movie. The mind building possibilities are endless. These machines would be uncoupled from biology, presenting endless possibilities and ethical dilemmas. It wouldn't be an AI innovation without the common ethical dilemmas that come with it. Building conscious AI raises profound ethical questions. What rights would these entities have? And how would they coexist with humanity? Would they have their own system? Will governments actually be separating AI and humans in the future? As we journey into this brave new world of AI, one thing is clear. The future holds astonishing possibilities, unknown challenges, and a fundamental shift in our understanding of what it seems to be conscious. All this discussion is nothing more than a glimpse into the unknown. We can theorize and plan all we want, but at the end of the day, most of this is purely speculation. So the question remains, can AI truly wake up and achieve consciousness? We don't know. 
at least for now. While we're not there yet, the road ahead promises to be a fascinating, if not tumultuous, journey. Stay tuned as we continue to explore the frontiers of AI and technology. Thanks for joining us today. Until next time, keep dreaming of the future, and remember, the answers might just be a click away. Here at Amazing AI, we always make sure to provide you with news and other updates in relation to this field of knowledge. If you want to stay tuned to what the Amazing AI channel has yet to offer, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next video.